Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do an eyebrow tutorial. I'm going to show you how I get my eyebrows to look perfect, luscious, thick, all of that. So if you want to see how I achieve my eyebrows, please keep on watching and don't forget to subscribe and also hit that notification bell next to the subscription button. All right. All right guys, so to do my eyebrows to achieve the perfect brow, I use three products. I use my Anastasia, ooh, my bad. I use my Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Brow Wiz, and this is in the shade Medium Brown. I use my Morphe Micro Pencil, and this is in the shade Chocolate Mousse. And I also use my Handy Dandy LA Girls Pro Concealer, and this is in the shade Warm Honey. Now, um, I do use a different foundation, like for when I do like my natural look. Let me see if I can find it. <clears throat> I use Fawn, or I'll use my um, matte concealer in NC45. So what I like to do is I like to start with my Morphe pencil, micro pencil, and it has a brush at the end. So I just use that and I brush my eyebrows up. Now I do need to get my eyebrows arched. So um, what I do is I just like to go over like where I'm, I'm growing hair at and I'll just cover that up with concealer right here. Like I can arch it, but sometimes I get scared like I'm gonna mess up. So I just don't bother it until it's time for me to go um, get my eyebrows did. So I'm gonna take the pencil and I just like to start at the end of my eyebrow. I'm using this um, mirror right here, so that's why I'll be looking down. So I just like to make an outline first of how I want my eyebrows to be. And I just do it um, drawing lightly with the pencil and I just make my way up to the front. So once I got that outline for the bottom of my, eye, um, my eyebrow, I'm talking too fast, I need to slow down. I just do the top, and the top is pretty easy because I don't have hair that's growing up and I, you know, like to keep that that way. So I'm just gonna do an outline for the top of my brow. And since my eyebrow is already so full right here, I only outline like midway of my eyebrow down. So once I got that together, then I fill it in and I do hair strokes. I just um, lightly with the pencil. Just until I don't see any gaps. I'll just go outline that a little bit thicker because I'm going with my concealer anyway. So now I got the front, not the front, the back of my eyebrows did. I can go in a little bit more up here. All right, so the back of my eyebrows is done. Now I go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Brow Wiz and I do the front and I just do hair like strokes in the front. Now I use this lighter pencil because I want it to look as natural as possible. So that's why I use this lighter shade. When I get closer, when I get to the very top of my eyebrows, I just brush up. All right, so there we go. Nice natural looking eyebrow. It's gonna look even better when I do my concealer. So I'm gonna do the same thing on my other brow. I'm gonna brush up first. Make sure I get on this. See now this eyebrow is different. Like I think it's from me previously, like long time ago when I was in high school, I used to go get my eyebrows threaded from this lady. And I was very like consistent with it. So she knew where to arch my eyebrows and it just never grow back right, right here. So what we're gonna do, we have to do this eyebrow a little bit different because I don't have like a guideline of where my brow is supposed to be. 
So we're just going to make one how I want it to be. Alright, like that and then we're going to use the front. And when I do the outline, I don't make it so harsh. Just so when it's time for me to brush out my eyebrows for the final look, you, you won't see like that line of demarcation in your eyebrow. So there we go, we got that, how I want the eyebrow to look, and it looks like it'll be about the same. So now I'm gonna do the top of my brow. And don't worry if you mess up, because I have one a little thick right here. But we just, excuse me, we just gonna um, clean it up with concealer. Sorry, y'all. Once you get that desired look, or close to how you want <laughs> your eyebrows to look, you're just gonna fill it in. Keep in mind we're doing light strokes. See, when my eyebrows aren't good, I always have a hard time. So you see the difference in my eyebrows. We're gonna fix it. We're just trying to get it all filled in and stuff first, and then the concealer is going to help us out. So I'm just going to continue to fill this in and making it how I want it to be. I just went over it a little bit more to get it a little rounded because it looked it kind of like pointed. So yeah. And go fix the bottom of our brow. Make sure they look the same. And then the front again. Alright. So now we're going to take our brow whiz and do hair like strokes for the rest of the brow. And then upward motion strokes. <laughs> And that's even a term. I'm gonna just do that upwards. kind of look like sisters but not exactly they're kind of looking like cousins so I'm just gonna fix it a little bit more this looks like I need a little bit more eyebrows in the front all right we're close now this one just look oh lord y'all let me gonna fix it so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take my favorite concealer brush. This is the Morphe M432 brush. And it's just a flat brush. And I'm gonna take my concealer and I'm gonna carve out the brush. I'm using this little, um, ring palette from um, Black Opal. They actually sent it out to me. So I usually put my products on my hand when I was getting tired of that. So when they sent that out to me, that was like a blessing. Cause I was about to buy one off um, Amazon. They sent me one, so. <clears throat> so now I just, when I do my concealer, I like to start like midway right here and brush on that concealer. The reason I like to start this way is because this is where you put the most product at. So when you get to the front of your eyes, you won't use a whole bunch of product in the front and it'll be easier to blend with your makeup. And 
and then I brush downward so the concealer I brush it like midway to my lid not my lid but where my crease will be and it's okay if you go a little bit out of the you know past your brow so since I didn't get my eyebrows did you can see like see right here like some of my hairs so I'm just gonna take a little bit more concealer to conceal my hairs I mean they're not gonna be covered fully but I won't be able to tell <clears throat> so I don't blend yet I like to get my concealer all set first and let it dry down just a little bit and then I brush it out so we're gonna do the same on this brow do anyone have like a favorite brow? Like is it your left one or your right one? Let me know in the comments down below. Because this one is definitely my favorite brow. My left brow is the best brow. It's very important to have like a steady hand because if you don't, you mess up. I'm not saying my hand is very steady, but kind of get a grip on that brush, honey. All right, so the hard part for me is my top brow, because like I was saying, you gotta have a steady hand. So um, it's a certain way, like I like to hold my brush, I like to hold it closer to the thing, and I like to apply it that way. I get less fuck ups when I do it that way. So let's see. Let's see if I can do this. I get so nervous like doing this and I always have to go back over, you know, to do my eyebrows. Let me try this way and see what this works. Yeah, I don't know how to do this and stay in the frame. If your hand's not steady, you can always like go a little above your brow and then brush it down so you won't mess up your brow. But luckily this came out pretty good and I'm just brushing upwards. Alright, that, that wasn't too bad y'all. I was doing all that for nothing. All right, so we're gonna do the other side. <clears throat> All right, let me just go brush up. I'll be careful now. Brushing up my excess. Let's see what. Uh oh. Let's see. It don't look that bad. You can tell right there. You brush some of the concealer on there. Let me get a little fine. Just adding a little bit more concealer where I felt like it was go fade. So these are the brows. Now I just will let it sit for a little bit. Not that long, I'll probably say a couple minutes. Usually by the time I'm done with my brow, then it's time to blend it out. So what I'm gonna blend my eyebrows out with, this is the Lux Concealer Brush. And it's a real, real technique brush. And I'm just gonna use that to blend out my concealer. And what I like to do is I like to start at the bottom and blend out where it was at first and then I work my way up to the top. Sometimes I don't even touch the top, but I'm gonna blend it out a little bit. Alright, so here we go. Under this one. Ooh, ooh. 
pretty good, y'all. Looks good. Um, <clears throat> I'm really not good at like talk this teaching. <laughs> I think I did pretty good. Y'all let me know in the comments below how I did with this eyebrow tutorial. But I'm not done yet. Don't exit over yet, y'all. So I'm just gonna go back. Both of them had a little spoolie at the end of them, so it doesn't matter which one. But now I'm just gonna blend out this harsh, like, whatever in the front, just to give it, like, a look, natural look. See that? Yes, yes, baby. Look at the difference, y'all. That looks good, y'all. That shit looks good, y'all. This is probably like the best brows I have ever done in my life. And what I like to do also is I like to brush my hair up in the front. You see how it's giving me like the little hair-like effect. It don't just look too dark. I'm just doing this lightly. I'm not really brushing, brushing. I'm just doing it lightly. Look at this. I did that. So, this is the end of my eyebrow tutorial. I am going to finish my face and I'll come back on camera and then we'll talk then. So guys, this concludes how I do my eyebrows. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I also hope that I helped you guys achieve a perfect natural looking brow. And if I did, please like, comment, and subscribe. And also hit that notification bell on the site right next to the subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.